But first tonight we have some eye opening new numbers we're getting from Union County Schools just one week into this new school year. Nearly 2000 students and staff are out due to COVID or exposure to it. And a reminder, this district is mask optional and parents told our Indira Skiva they're concerned about these numbers and also how they're being released. According to that dashboard here at Parkwood High School, 17 students tested positive and at least 100 more are in quarantine. The parents I spoke to tonight tell me they are extremely concerned about these numbers. So all week I've been looking for those numbers. I Jennifer Carvajal says she hasn't sent her daughter back to school and Union County schools don't offer a virtual academy. Her teacher has been kind enough to send some worksheets for her to do at home. Carvajal says if the district doesn't reverse its mask mandate. She's considering homeschooling. She works from home and says it would be challenging. It'll be huge, but I think at this point we have to I have to think of her safety. The Union County School District has approximately 41,000 students. This week about 4% of students are in quarantine. The district says it'll update its COVID-19 dashboard every Friday. A mother who wanted to remain anonymous says she wishes the updates would be more frequent. As a parent who has three kids in the public school community, it's it's important for me to know what my child or children might be facing and the possibility that as the numbers continue every day, there is more likely case that my child might come in contact with someone who is positive. The Union County School Board is supposed to meet for their next regular meeting on September 7th, and parents tell me they hope that masks will once again come up. In Union County, Indira Esquiva, WCNC Charlotte.